any problems. None of us do. Our lives are unbelievably safe. Okay. I guess I just don't get it. Maybe Jesse can give you a little more excitement than I can. Here you go. Thank you. Jesse, please wait. Go away. I'm busy pressing my tux for the prom. Jesse, you can't hide forever. Yeah, well, according to my watch, forever is not such a long time. Jesse? That's all right, Mom. It's just uh, someone I know from school. I'm not leaving until you talk to me. Not here. Get it? Yeah. All the exciting details? That's not what I meant. I was visiting my sister up at state last winter break. And we went to this typical frat boy party. No parents, lots of people, lots of beer, real adult stuff. You know? I met this girl. We started dancing and getting to know each other. Pretty soon we ended up in her room. Slept with her? No, we played Twister. How could she do that to you? I mean, why didn't she tell you she had AIDS? She didn't know. So, you did it and you didn't even think? Oh, I didn't even think. How did you find out? I got a call one day from some clinic. She had gotten sick. Doctor gave her a test. I was on her dance card. So I went and got a test. Gives new meaning to the phrase getting lucky, don't you think? So it was just that one time? Sometimes that's how it happens. You're not even sick. Not yet. But it's inside of me, floating around, just waiting to go off. Bang, and I'm dead. What's the matter? Don't like to talk about it? Funny, it's my favorite subject. What do you think? Open or closed casket? I think it depends on how fast I die. Jesse, stop it. Yeah, it's too depressing, huh? Or maybe if I don't think about it, it'll go away. I just need something to take my mind off of it. I know. How about another kiss? You get it now? Why don't you just run along like a nice little girl and go tell all your friends about the new freak? I'm not going to tell anyone. Jesse, I'm still your friend. Jesse!